Well, incredibly, five of the six final fixtures have massive repercussions at both ends of the table. The title challenge has gone right down to the wire between Chelsea and Manchester City, but the focus here is fixated around the relegation dogfight. Visitors Bristol City, sitting at the foot of the table, know that only a win will do in their quest for final day survival. Even then, they would need one of either Aston Villa or Birmingham to lose respective games against Arsenal and Tottenham if the Robins are to retain their Barclays FA Women's Super League status for another season. Decent looking cross that, and Silly Fiskestrand has dropped it. It's Welling shot which is blocked, and Brighton just about clear their lines. Corner played short into Brazil, who returns it to Kagman. It's a decent looking cross, Bagley's there, and it's turned in inside the six yard area by May Leticia. The 19 year old. <laughs> Well, what a season she's had. It's her 25th start in all competitions this campaign. And it's a deserved goal for a young defender who's been on fire this season. But for Bristol City, that's a huge setback. Bristol City switched off. Kayleigh Green's in here. Tracks her effort though across goal and she's frustrated with herself. Givens from the byline tries to get it in. It's cleared only as far as Kaylee Green, who couldn't keep her shot down. Clipping forward, looking for Green, and it might drop here to Coivisto. Drilled into the centre. And in the end, slid clear as far as Simpkins. He might take the shot on here. Blocks by Skills that time and hacked clear by Molly Pike. Bristol City taking the chance to press high again, but they're in trouble here. The flick on header from Gemma Evans has presented an opportunity for Ellie Brazil, who can make it too, but Bagley denies her with her feet. Brazil looks wide for Kagman. This is Coy Visto. Slips it through for Green. Lee holds her run. It's deflected towards the South Korean, who tees up Kagman just over the top from the Dutch midfielder. Whelan heads on to Lee. Almost slipped. Helps on to Ellie Brazil. Another good looking cross in came Koi Visto. And now Lee Jung Min in off the crossbar. Three goals in two for Lee Jung-Min. And for Bristol City, it's a real uphill battle now. They've made the worst possible start to the second half. But Lee Jung-Min ending her lone spell at Brighton in some style. On to Salmon, up against Coy Visto. Salmon too quick for the finished fullback. Our effort blocked by Mayor Leticia. Palmer sends it wide to Perfield. A couple of touches out of her feet. Lofted cross, Daniels lurking. Back across goal. Abby Harrison's there, it's in. And Bristol City have half the deficit. With about half an hour to play, Abby Harrison off the bench has her first goal since October. And there is life in this Bristol City side still. Evans volleys forward, helped on by Harrison. Salmon tries to race onto it. She could be away here, Ebony Salmon, but back went Coy Visto. So send it back to Fisker Strand. Beautiful turn from Ebony Salmon, driving forward here, up against Leticia. Turn smartly, managed to dig out a shot too. Salmon just wide. And you'd have thought if this goes in. That'll be Bristol City, all but relegated. And it goes from Kagman, deflected in. Brighton restore their two-goal lead. And is that the final nail in the coffin for Bristol City? Well, a free kick took a wicked deflection. But Bristol City are back to needing three goals.
Brazil then to Kagman, who was onside, but lost out momentarily. Elie Brazil, though, can break away for Brighton. Away from skills, but couldn't keep her effort down, Elie Brazil. Skills dives in on Whelan. That's a wonderful ball, and Ebony Salmon could be away here. First touch takes her a little bit wider than she'd have wanted to. Gets the shot away, though, Salmon just over the top. It's all over at the People's Pension Stadium. Bristol City's four-year stay in the Barclays FA Women's Super League has come to an end.